going back to, back to practicing. Yep. Is there anything you can think of where you might be able to recreate a moment where you know you were almost in trouble? Yeah, definitely. Um, what I realised I didn't do on the stage this time is I didn't compose myself enough. So when I had two or three clear darts at a double, or even one dart at a double, I didn't stop, take a big breather, you know, at crucial times. I just got a bit through it. So I kind of rushed it, if that, if that makes sense. Um, so I'd definitely be working on that, um, composing myself at crucial points. So, yeah, that'd be it for me. And obviously your, your family were a big motivation for you to get you through that game. Oh, yeah, definitely. And will, will you be looking to them maybe a bit more? Next game, yeah, hundred um, percent. I don't think I looked over at them enough in the game this time, and that, that might be why I was two sets to nil down. Uh, but w when it mattered, I started looking over to them, and they really pushed me through that game. So, um, yeah, um, I think from the offset against Steve West, I'll be looking straight over to my family for support because uh, they got me through that game. So hopefully, they get me through that one. Do you think the crowd got, through, got you through as well? They yeah, definitely. Uh, the crowd, yeah, that, they were amazing. Uh, they was really behind me which really feels unusual because I don't normally have that because uh, I play a lot in Germany and I get a lot of it against me. Um, so, yeah, that was lovely to have the crowd on my side. Last year I played at the Worlds, I had Raymond Van Barnabad and oh, clearly they'll be of Raymond because he's an awesome player. So, yeah, it was nice tonight to have the crowd on my side and I think they got me through it as well. So Hopefully you can uh, progress as well. Yes. Thanks for lovely. Thank you very much, Patrick.